everybody, Jason here from Ghostbusters News, and today we're going to be building the iconic Hook and Ladder 8 as we take a look at the brand new Ghostbusters Firehouse Headquarters Jigsaw Puzzle from Revit 3D. And I cannot wait to open this one up and start putting it together piece by piece, but first we've got to take a look at the box. On the front here provides a nice overview of both the front and the back of the firehouse, as well as a couple of additional Easter eggs that we're going to touch on a little bit later in today's video. Flipping the box around at the back here, there's not really too much to see outside of the fact that while there are instructions included, it does advertise that interactive online instructions and tools that are a bit more in depth, they are available. And in opening things up, you'll be presented with 500 puzzle pieces. And uh, I, got, I got to point out the first one I noticed here, uh, of course, of the Stay Puff Marshmallow Man. And I don't expect you to sit there and watch me build this thing, uh, because honestly, I, I think for you, that may be a bit of a bore. For me, it's going to be tremendous fun. But through the power of video editing... There we go, fully constructed, the Ghostbusters Firehouse Headquarters from Rebit 3D, and to say the least, I, I love the look of this thing. The printing in each piece looks great, despite the fact that some creative liberties, they were taken with the overall design of this build, which just measures shy of 12 inches in height. I also got to add here that there is no doubt a Ghostbusters fan within Rebit 3D's design team, because this thing, it is jam-packed full of Easter eggs. Some of which are a lot more evident. In fact, I think some of them can't really be considered Easter eggs. Like, I don't know, this massive image here of the Stay Puft Marshmallow Man standing alongside the building. Also, not only returning in Ghostbusters Frozen Empire, but seen here on this 3D jigsaw puzzle inside the firehouse, we've got the disgusting Green Blob Slimer. Looking around here too, we've got other ghostly apparitions, spectral characters. This includes the library ghost. And I know I just mentioned Frozen Empire, and that is because this build, it does embrace recent entries into the franchise. As right here, we have got the adorable yet mischievous mini puffs. They're positioned there next to a ghost trap and continuing with this Where is Waldo like quest, a more than welcome nod to my favorite Ghostbusters film, Ghostbusters 2, looking inside here in the window, a psychomagnetheric slime filled toaster. Oh, and this printed damage atop the firehouse, it's great. Referencing the first Ghostbusters movie when Walter Peck, he shut down the protection grid. Again, I'm going to say it, jam-packed full of Easter eggs, 20 in total. Uh, really, any Ghostbusters fan, they're going to appreciate those. As well, uh, another thing that I really appreciate is these added builds that were included. And this includes both the Ghostbusters, Ecto-1, and Slimer. And some of you, you may recall Rebbit's first Ghostbusters 3D jigsaw puzzle, which was the Ecto. This here is obviously a much more simplified build with similar printing. And then taking a look at Slimer, he's made up of two pieces plus a base allowing him to stand, or should I say hover, outside of the firehouse. Oh, and another really cool detail to this set, and I'm unsure if this is even on purpose, but the way that you install the front doors. You can easily remove them, meaning if you like to have the Ecto-1 pulling out of the firehouse for display, you can totally do that. So Ghostbusters fans, if you would like to build your very own Ghostbusters Firehouse Headquarters piece by piece, this brand new 3D puzzle from Rebit 3D, it is now in stock. And of course, you know, we've got that purchase link down below in today's video. With that said, that's all I've got for you for this one. As always, subscribe. If you'd like to join up with Ghostbusters News, check out our Patreon page. A link to that is also down below. And we'll see you right back here next time.